I was walking our dog one day and she saw a cat and I tried to stop her and I sprained my ankle. And then for like two months, it didn't get better. And I was like, I think we should get this checked out. When they first were telling me everything and when they were like, hey, you have osteosarcoma, I was sort of confused. It felt really intense. Like it felt like everything stopped for a moment when he first said it. It was awful because as a parent, you know there is nothing you can do. This is not your fight. You can only be there to support your child. We didn't know anything. So we relied on Children's to walk us through this, to take us on this journey, this path that we had no idea was even gonna take this long because of where the cancer was at. He said, you have some choices, but basically you can do limb salvage or amputation. Those are your choices. When we get a little bit closer, we'll go over it more in depth. Um, that way Michaela could be involved with that conversation. That's a hard choice and a very adult choice. I didn't ever want her to feel like I made the decision for her. I've had 12 surgeries, a lot of them on my leg for amputation and such, and I've had a lot of them on my lungs. The team prepared me for what I was gonna have to deal with, basically by just explaining everything and making sure I knew what was going on. If I had any questions, I could just ask them. I didn't have to feel worried or concerned about anything that was going on. Like, I could just know what was happening, straightforward, no like sugarcoating or anything. When I met Dr. Roach, I was super worried about everything that was going on and everything that I had to deal with. And when they told me that it had spread to my lungs, I was really concerned. Then he came in and he was like explaining the surgery and I was like, I felt like 10 times better about everything. And he's just, he's very lighthearted about everything. You need all of these great minds to be able to put all of the pieces together. It's a puzzle. And without all of them, the pieces don't all fit together. I think some of the best things about being here at Children's versus any other hospital is just how welcoming it is. Like, they, this hospital really cares and it doesn't care who you are as a person, what you look like, how you act, anything. Like, they just wanna be there to make sure that you're okay and all that. While I was at Children's, I just, I met so many people and I just sort of really realized that I wasn't the only person going through everything. Like I wasn't alone. And I've met, I've made so many friends. I've met so many kids. I like being able to see my nurses and my team and just everyone that, every, all the amazing people I met here. Just, I've had a lot of amazing experiences for an unfortunate reason. There's not enough stars for the care, <laughs> I, it's been phenomenal. I couldn't have asked for a better team.